Oh, thank you, Graham. Well, you know what? For an authentic taste of Paris in a, uh, in a classic croissant washed down with a cup of coffee, you don't need to fly thousands of miles anymore. Ooh la la, the world-famous Paul Bakery restaurant opened its doors in South Africa over the weekend. And I must say, South Africans are in for a delicious and luxurious treat. Bon appétit. If only all of us could hop on a plane to Paris to grab a quick croissant and coffee. Well, I think I may have found the next best thing. Founded over 128 years ago in France, Paul's Bakery Restaurant can now be found across the globe, including right here in our backyard at their newest bakery in Moe's Arch, Johannesburg. So if you can't get to Paris, a piece of Paris has been brought to you. However, the question on everyone's lips is, who is Paul? Bonsoir, je m'appelle Liane Lamini. Bonsoir from Paul's Patisserie. Enchanté. Bonsoir. I think it's incredible. It is perfectly South African, but it still embodies what Paul is and what I know Paul to be, so it's very special. I have been traveling for many years and I've lived overseas, so Paul is definitely always on my list. The origin of Paul Bakery can be traced back to 1889 in the small town of Juan in northern France, where Charlemagne Mayo and his wife owned a small, busy bakery. All of the recipes have been passed down through five generations, but when it comes to the decor, there's a perfect blend of old and new, with checkered floors and pressed walls. But if there's one thing that you cannot miss, it is the massive display of fresh pastries and sandwiches. Which brings me back to the question, how does Paul get it so right? The Paul brand opened its first bakery outside of France in 1985, and now there are over 400 stores around the world. I feel like I've come to Paris for the night. You're in the streets, there's street entertainment, there are these beautiful little lights and the stunning food that is just unbelievable. I'm loving this. I just think this is just such a, a fabulous addition to Johannesburg. It's a very beautiful restaurant. They bring in France to South Africa, you know, for those people that can't go to France. So it's really exciting to just have that experience here. And you know, you're going to say, I'm going to France, but you'll be here at Mauro's. Every product at Paul is traditionally made and produced fresh each day. It's part of the commitment to maintain superior quality and offer an authentic French bakery experience. Maxime, we are so excited to welcome Paul to South Africa, but I think the biggest question on everyone's lips is, who is Paul? After the Second World War, my grandparents, so the, the, the third generation, decided to buy a bakery which name was Paul, because that bakery has been created by Mr. and Mrs. Paul. And when we have expanded the business, because Paul was known in Lille, the first bakery in Paris, you know, we kept the name and we did the same all over the world. Maxime, what would you say is your top trending pastry or product that you offer? The best sell in the 34 countries in which we are operating is the croissant. So I, I believe that really when people come to Paul, they really want to try, you know, and find the French taste. So the croissant is very popular. We've got cakes, small cake, which is called millefeuille, which is simply delicious. So the millefeuille and the éclair will be my recommendation to you. Speaking of recipe, is there any chance you can let me know what that secret recipe is? I promise you I won't tell anyone. I'm really sorry because you know it's really a secret that we are keeping uh, for five generations but what about sharing uh, with you, you know, the secret of the French kiss? No, no, I'm fine. You can keep that secret to yourself. I am on a mission to find the secret recipe. Hi, sorry. You wouldn't perhaps know the secret recipe to the croissants. The secret recipe for the croissants? I'm sorry, but it's a secret. Hence, secret recipe, you can't have it. Pretty please? Well, I managed to taste the croissants and it was to die for. I am in love and I'm definitely gonna come back and get it here. <laughs> I have tried their croissants and they are incredible. It's that just perfectly crispy on the outside and as you go inside it's just got that buttery taste inside and it just sort of flakes and melts in your mouth. Is there anything better? Us South Africans, we love food. We're very particular about food and to have a true French experience and food experience, we can't ask for anything better. I finally found the special ingredients to the secret recipe. Heritage, family and love. I think it's time I give France a visit.